is uh, Chef Otis, and right now I'm in my kitchen. I'm preparing a couple of uh, recipes here that I created. And right now, what I'm doing right now is I have a, I'm sauteing a red bell pepper. I love the red bell pepper as opposed to the green bell pepper. I think the red bell pepper has much, much more uh, healing properties, a lot of antioxidants, uh, elasticity, antioxidization in this red pepper, and it's a great cancer fighter, too. It helps to replenish the white blood cells. So what I'm doing is I'm sauteing this red pepper right now with some onions and just saute just a little bit just to release some of the uh, juices in it. I'm also going to work on uh, doing some juice today, which is my favorite. Right now I'm doing a lot of juicing. I'm going to be doing uh, carrots and beets. And this is my juicer right here. And then the next thing I'm going to juice is I'm going to juice some kale. Wow. Isn't that beautiful? Just remember when you're juicing your kale, you can juice it just the way it is, or if you want to sweeten it up a bit, you can uh, juice it with, some, with an apple or something. So if you want to start juicing it, the stalk first. You want to go down to... You want to start juicing with the stalk first and push it down to the leaves. And then, like I said earlier, if you really want to sweeten the kale up a little, you just add juice, a little of, of apple or two with that, and it'll bring out the nice sweet flavors of it. Okay? I'm doing a, uh, I'm going to do a Western omelet with this. And I've already sauteed my red bell pepper, and, and I like red onions, because red onion to me is a lot easier to digest. I guess you're probably wondering what this is I'm drinking here. While I'm cooking, I'm always drinking something. This is the tea that I drink here. It's a green tea. And uh, this is all I drink every day, twice a day, three times a day sometimes. So this is where I'm at right now. Chef Otis in his kitchen. We're going to be doing a Western omelet here with the turkey. I, uh, I only use these large brown cage free eggs here if you like eggs. And... Uh, <coughs> I'm going to add a little shaved turkey to this. I only use the best olive oil, which is Mazzola olive oil out of the Mediterranean area. And if you're going to use salt, use sea salt. Sea salt has, uh, is much better than iodized salt. Sea salt has trace minerals in it, and it's less sodium. If you use salt, it's better not to use any salt at all. So there you have it, guys. Chef Otis in his kitchen, doing his thing, creating re recipes, and as always, I want to inform you guys that my new cookbook is out. Uh, Food for Thought. It's out. It's available. All you have to do is go to Google Chef Otis Wagner, and you'll see the cookbook will come right up. Plus a little more history about me and my career. And again, you know, I want to thank you guys for tuning in with us. We're going to be giving you some great ideas, good recipes every day. Every other day, we're going to be coming up with new ideas. And a lot of my recipes are right in that booklet right there. And I uh, really appreciate you guys. You can find me on Facebook. It's Chef Otis Wagner. And uh, as always, I want to thank you for tuning in with me in my kitchen. And have a great day and a great life.